this isn't like a different thing, right? Yeah. Imagine like, <laughs> yeah, like this guy. The people are just crafting here. It's like, oh yeah, what do 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 do? I'm just leveling my crafters. Meanwhile, ah, everybody's suffering, depressed. The shop appears to have weathered the chaos. Those wares have been strewn across the floor. The sound of crafters hard at work. I could just pretend they're trying to build materials to help fix the town or the city back up. Meanwhile, this kid wants to play some freaking card games. The port remains unscathed, but the enemy ships continue to loom overhead. It's surreal how you have to survey the damage and then there's crafters in the middle of a blast marking hammering away. Yeah. Oh well, what can you do? I think it'd be more of a pain in the butt to send you into like an instance of the destroyed town only to have you come back to the town after when it's like fixed. The kid is traumatized and the only way to deal is to play card games. Also just imagine, someone just started, like if someone just started the expansion, arrived here, it's like oh everything looks happy. Meanwhile you have someone that's way farther in MSQ, god damn I'm so depressed right now. It's like why? It's like oh you'll 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 find out in like forty hours. Merchants like yeah we're still functioning just fine. You can't not access the merchants. Hunt board is going on. This person's still here in case you want to do their quest right now for some reason. You know what? Just 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 because I want to see, and I have an excuse to do something for Reaper. Well, I never. To think I'd run into you in Tuliola of all places. I'm from the Studium's Faculty of Biology. I've seen you before, back in Old Charlie. <laughs> ah, that reminds me, you'll have to forgive the impertinence, but there just so happens to be a matter I could use your help with. I'm researching Turali ecosystems and currently on the hunt for one creature in particular. <laughs> in truth, I'd barely set foot on land before I made my discovery. Alas, I was trying to secure the specimen for study, but it got away from me. It has a somewhat peculiar cry to say the least. The creature itself is covered in a tawny brown fur and is rather small in stature. The strangest thing is, I asked some of the locals whether they had heard of such an animal and they seemed quite baffled. You don't know, you, you don't happen to know what the creature I speak of, do you? Uh, squeal! In times of sadness, the, it helps to brighten up the mood. Aha! You mean to discern the animal's habitat and mannerisms by imitating its try cry? Quite remarkable. It seems I'm in the presence of a budding naturalist. Well, I shan't be outshone in my own field. The creature must be captured. I shall conduct an extensive search of the port, which is where I first saw the creature. Might I ask you to search high ground, the residential district known as Resplendent Quarter? <laughs> Scientists, help me <laughs> find rest. A resident fine creature. <laughs> the resident, my family, friends, and dead. And the best part is nobody, like nobody here knows. The only people that are aware are you guys watching the stream right now. No one knows I'm doing this. What is this? this is a groundhog? Squeal? The vocal varmint and his companions seem willing to follow you. Lead the pair back to the naturalist. Sure. Oh my god, that's adorable. Thank goodness these varmints survived this utter destruction. Quickly, I must bring them to the safety of the scientist. <laughs> you log a rook the shower, you're doing a psycho. <laughs> but Suna, who would believe you? <laughs> no one would know. No one would know. <laughs> I could do all these side quests right now in the middle of all this chaos. This drum major! This person's con concerned about the drums right now. The music playing right now, the mousey, the thing. <laughs> I real, what's up? Look, I'm doing side quests! <laughs> Look, I'm helping some scientists bring these animals in. Even more so, it's important! What if these little fellas died? I gotta make sure I bring them to safety. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, we have this music playing during all this. But 
Brilliant. Simply brilliant. Not one, but two. I only spotted a single specimen earlier. Little did I think there'd be another lurking nearby. Squeal, squeal, squeal. They both seem remarkably docile. What a marvelous stroke of luck to be reunited with my quarry so quickly. This rather vindicates my decision to travel all this way. Recently, my fellow researchers and I have been vying for a tenured position within the faculty. This discovery is exactly what I need to give me the upper hand during the selection process. Suffice it to say, I'll be keeping a close eye on these two and tending to them with utmost care. I can't wait to conduct a thorough study. We did it. Okay, you know what? Just because I'm gonna start doing random side quests right now. <laughs> People are in fear and I'm just doing side quests. <laughs> Even better, I'm doing them as <laughs> as a reaper. <laughs> Hello, Landsguard. Ah, how goes it this fine, fair evening? Breathtaking, isn't it? <laughs> I wager you'd be hard-pressed to find a more majestic drum anywhere. <laughs> Alas, exposed as it is to the elements, it requires a lot of upkeep, which is where we find where we have the fife and drum corps come in. Speaking of which, what's taking him so long? Hmm, I don't know, maybe he died? Say, you strike me as a dependable sort. Might I trouble you to find our new recruit? He was tasked with handling today's inspection. Given how long it's taking him, it's possible that he ran into trouble. But I'm supposed to be supervising things here. Check behind the tower and you should find <laughs> Honestly, this makes these side quests way more funny. <laughs> Given the context right now. It's like, ah oh, yes, new recruit. We gotta go fix up these drums. <laughs> I know you just survived an attack. Where are you? Uh, can I help you? Wait. The drum major sent you? Gods be good, I've wasted too much time. I've already finished checking the drum and tower, mind you. But I just had to go and drop my tools. Now I can't find them. Will you help me look? I could really use a scan pair of eyes right now. A clean drum for a clear sound. Oh, there's his stuff. That one Mamuja. I'm here to drum. Oh, I'm so glad you found them. You're a lifesaver, truly. If I dared to report back without them, the Major would have me grilled me, uh, grilled me to a fine char. But that said, I really must return to my other duties. I'd be most grateful if you could inform the Major on my behalf. Yeah, yeah, see look, this guy was so busy looking for his instruments, now he can go back to helping people! There you are. I'm told you helped our recruit find the inspection kit after you dropped it. Your generosity means more to our community than you might realize. See, I'm helping. I'm helping. This drum is essential for the protection and well-being of our people. See? If not, it not only marks the time of day, but also honors the Landsguard returning home from duty. And in times of crisis, it can be used to warn the populace of danger. <laughs> I see, look, the drum was important! Needed to warn them of danger! <laughs> this is why we must keep up, keep it in pristine condition at all times. But of course, our most common duty is, as the fife and drum corps is to perform as a musical ensemble. It makes tremendous upper arm strength to beat the drum of this scale. And as major, my job is to pound our greenest recruits into shape. Perhaps I've been slacking. Before I forget, take this, you've earned it. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Lama T is crying right now, I need your shoulder, you just- Ooh, it's like... <laughs> Listen, the fact that they let you do these side quests during this time of importance, that's the dev's fault. 
They could have made it so you couldn't interact with quests. But here we are. I'm helping other people out. Oh hey, we get pants. Hey you, you're not busy, are you? Earlier we got word of a shipment of parts has come in. So I sent my trainee to fetch them. But he's still not back yet. Boy, all these people sending their trainees out and wondering why they're not back yet. All this wreckage. Are you alright? What happened? Meanwhile, the Junkmonger. The trainee mechanic from the dirigible landing? No, I'm afraid I haven't seen him today. Might be as if he took a scenic route, as often he won't do. Seeing as you're looking for him, you might as well take the delivery along with you. Knowing who Volja, he won't be satisfied until bro both are brought to him. As for where his young charge might be, I often see him on the pier at High Tide Harbor, gazing out at sea. Like as not, you'll find him there now. Thanks, friend. Uh, you go, you go do your thing. Oh hey, peddler friend. Hello. Ooh, I'm in the pickle. Can't exactly deliver the order if I'm lost now, can I? Curse these twisting streets. Ah yes, the streets that are twisted from all the destruction. You there, with your decidedly unflappable composure. You know your way around these streets, yes? Could you pay a visit to my customers and let them know I brought their workers? <laughs> ah yes, your customers that are just waiting in the destruction. Brilliant, now you'll look for two different houses in the resplendent quarter. The first has deep blue and yellow walls with what feather decorations that hang from the eaves. The man who lives there is a very elegant Hanu Hanu. The second is home to a rather voracious moblin. You're looking for sky blue walls and a yellow roof, a storehouse and a decorative vase is out front. <laughs> Damn, I gotta make deliveries during the destruction. People need their supplies. Dear me, you mean to say my package has arrived? I had some dried reeds imported from Okano, you see. Ordered them as soon as they heard the crops had recovered. Though I may live in Tuiola now, I always keep my homeland close to heart. To a Hanu Hanu like myself, there is no greater comfort than the smell of reeds when I walk through the door. Speaking of which, I had better go fetch them, hadn't I? There are a few areas I could do with a bit of touching up. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, yes, you gotta you gotta touch up the, the house a bit. There might be some black splotches here and there. Hello. Why has it gotten so quiet out there? I'm not sure I want to find out. No, I think what I need to do right now is a warm soothing- These people don't know! They don't know! They don't know, guys! It's like you just stayed home and there was a world-ending disaster outside and you just never leave home. Would never have found out about that dialogue. I bet it sounds different when Tuliola is the wreck. The devs actually put some thought into random NPC dialogues. Ah, special order of mold flour is here at last. I have all the ingredients to crafty bake loaves of rot bread. Haven't heard of mold flour? Mixy blend of wheat and meat. Uh, mycotoxins with a sweet stink smell. In Earthenshire, all breads and cookies are crafty baked with it. Essential element of traditional mobby cuisine. Since stingy shopkeepers of Tuliola refused to stock it, my only option was to bulk buy with a pelu pelu goods bearer. Now to go and bring back my package. Many thanks to kind lowlander. Um, hey lady, will you help me? Earlier today I got a pretty painting of the city from a Shitona painter. And I showed it to my mom, she really liked it. Then she sent me to deliver this fruit as thank you gift. But now the painter isn't here anymore, I don't know what to do. Could you help me look around? Kid, I'm sorry to say, but maybe the painter died. Okay, painter was going to make one more picture like this. Well, I can tell you for certain, <laughs> their painting's probably ruined now. Which means whenever we can see this view, that's where we'll find- Oh no, it's gonna be- <laughs> Oh no. Let's go find that painter. <laughs> Hello. How's the view, friend? Greetings, traveler. Oh, and I see you've brought the little Mamulja from earlier. I was looking all over for you. My mom said to give you this as our thanks for the pretty painting. 
You came all this way to thank me with a snack? You're far too kind, little one. It was a little more than a doodle. I was awarded enough by the smile on your face. I take it you're her chaperone then. Thank you for looking out for her. This town has a special place in my heart. We Shitona are long-lived people, and I have had the good fortune of watching the community sprout up from nothing. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> the banning! I see the dark splotches! At least you can't see the warships in the sky! I used to think this country would never amount to much, but seeing all these vibrant cultures thriving alongside one another in harmony, I wish to immortalize its beauty with what talent yet remains to me. Oh no, the warships! <laughs> They're in the cutscene! <laughs> you must really love Tuliola, huh? Well, don't worry, me and my mom are going to love your painting forever and ever and ever. <laughs> it's an honor, little one. <laughs> now then, seeing as I finished my current painting, I think it's time I found a new vista to admire. I hope I see you around, friends. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is just so funny, though. <laughs> I never really thought about how pretty our town is. I feel like I learned something today. <laughs> Here you go, kid. Thanks again for helping me find the painter, lady. I'm going to take good care of this picture, that I will. But before you go here, this is for you. Yo, peddler friend. I got your your Uber deliveries. I see you managed to find them. Thanks to you, the packages have safely reached my customer's hands. Uh, pause? Claws? In the meantime, I've been browsing Bayside Bevy. The shops here have all the most common daily necessities, along with a variety of goods from other far-flung corners of Tudal. But Teoliola is a melting pot of cultures with their own unique needs. And sometimes the limited selection here doesn't cut it. That's where we come in. As peddlers, we travel to those distant locales buy their sought-after goods and deliver them to residents here. For a price, mind. Speaking of travel, did you come here from Eorzea by any chance? I've yet to venture out there for the import goods. But one of these days, I might just have to make the trip. Oh, and before I forget, here's your fee. Ah, oh, one more quest and our Reaper will be 91. Perfect. I can't believe it. How could our own commander? No, there's no time for that. I have a duty to uphold as a proud member of the Lands Guard. Patrol partner? Yes, I'm the one he's looking for. I don't know why he's always so needlessly punctual, but there are in fact still a few minutes before our shift. And then again, patience has never been a strong suit. In any case, thank you for letting me know. I suppose I'll head over earlier. Just to be nice. Yeah, see, I gotta get these guards on patrol. They gotta make sure all the citizens are looked after. The first riddle I gave you will point you to the right direction. Ah, uh, yes, treasure hunting. During the devastation. Such devastation! This was not my intention! I must help the poor people of Tuliola in their time of need. Well met, Traveler. Couldn't help but notice you staring at my crops there, dabbling in a bit of sowing and growing yourself. How about running a quick errand for me? By way of thanks, I'll share some of the know-how we local farmers have cultivated over the years. Right, it all starts with compost. And that's where you come in. I need your help getting a hold of the makings that go into the mulch and you can't go wrong with alpaca manure. No need to look so worried. I'll get the dung delivered from the alpaca stables later. What I want you to do is go around collecting vegetable scraps for me. I've got an arrangement with some eateries here in Tuliola, you see. I need you to pay a visit to Zabal Tea and Aunt T's Tacos. Think you can do that for me? Ah, yes, yes. I gotta collect scraps during this emergency. The man needs his veggie scraps. He needs to grow the food. Tea soldier. Tapa peels after his vegetable wraps, eh? Say no more. To make decent taco, you can't cut corners when it comes to meat and spices, but vegetables are just as vital. 
Mine are packed with the f best produce you can get, and all of it grown by Tapapia himself. We business owners have to look out for one another, after all. Yes, especially in these times of need. For a tasty taco, vegetables are just- okay. T-Soul is just gonna talk about tacos. <laughs> Even when the city's in ruin or in despair, gotta talk about tacos. The heck? The rustling of his corn sounds not like the dejected sigh, and you could swear it looks like it's looking out to the ocean. Oh, woe is me. What's the matter? I'm talking to corn. You. you can see me? Oh no, guys, I've gone crazy. Oh, blessed be! For countless ages I have watched over these lands. When man first tilled her soil, I was there. When they partook of her bounty, I was there. A silent guardian of harvest, my presence unmistakable. Yet the passage of time would bring change to the people. They began to forget the old ways. Forget me! I traveled the lands, hither and yon, yet no matter where I went, I remained unseen and unheard. I feared before long I might be struck, this nigh immortal cob. Yet here at last I found a kindly soul able willing to lend me an ear. An ear of corn? But will she lend me a hand as well? I wondered. I wish to help the people of Tural. Fill their hearts and bellies both, lest their hunger invite terrible misfortune. Oh see look! This is important! He wants to feed the people of Tural and you know they could use some food right now. All that all that are born into this world are deserving of happiness, which not agree, so let them eat, I say. Eat corn and be merry. <laughs> Did you pass on and write this unconsciously, Zuna? <laughs> it's filled with corn puns. <laughs> Alas, I cannot reach them in my diminished state, but you can! And so I shall bequeath unto you the most delectable corn dishes, which are then to be distributed unto the masses. What say you? Such selflessness, such compassion! How long has it been since last I met a soul so grossly incandescent? Where have I heard that line before? Oh, hello there. I will stay behind to gaze at the sun. The sun is a wondrous body, like a magnificent father. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. I am but the humble stock basking in the warmth of your generous heart. Well, my friend, let us be off. The curious corn spirit has elected to re be referred to as the corn servant. Speak with them again when you are ready to spread corn and happiness to masses. Alright, we gotta feed the people. Fear not, child. Do not worry about the destruction. Here, have some corn. What am I to do now? I'm like to starve at this rate. His belly. It speaks to me. I bid you offer him this grilled corn, seared to perfection with the hope that yet burns in my corny bosom. Can we have this guy as a minion? Is that grilled corn for me? Yes, some elotes. That's awfully kind of you. I'm new to Tuliola. It's been pretty hard. Harder since I lost my job. I've been so hungry lately I can barely think straight. Oh boy. I mean, I, I can see why you might have lost your job. But the smell of this corn with its smoky sweet aroma has brightened my day. I can hardly wait to eat it. Feels like maybe my luck is starting to turn around. Thank you, miss. I won't forget this. I'm just your friendly neighborhood reaper. Hungry woman. Walking down the street. Hungry woman. Uh, perhaps I'll simply skip dinner today. I feel that cities in ruins don't want to eat. A belly and heart both in dire need of nourishment. Here, take my take of my cob. Let its earthy scent and savory flavors offer her comfort. 
Here, lady. An elote. Grilled corn? My husband loves... Lo loved. Oh no, I'm sorry. Life simply isn't the same without him. One moment I think I'm fine, then suddenly I find myself brought to tears. Even if eating has been a struggle, but I know he wouldn't want me to mourn him. Thank you for this, I'll try to do better, for his sake and mine. Damn, this is probably the most relevant side quest so far. Hey Alphano, how you doing? The people are shaken. We must do what we can to help them, and quickly. Yes, yes, I'm passing out elotes to the, those that are hungry. They won't have to worry about empty bellies. You there, good sir. You look like you can use an elote. I'm so hungry, but I have no money. May the gods forgive me for what I'm about to do. Do you hear that, friend? His belly weeps from hunger. Pray offer him this corn. Let its smoky sweetness give him comfort and deliver him from foul temptation. Is this grilled corn for me? Truly! My stomach has been in knots for days. Thank you. It shames me to admit it, but I tried my hand at gambling and lost everything. I was so desperate for food I was tempted to do terrible, terrible things. This corn has filled my aching stomach and helped to clear my head. Oh, what a fool I've been. It's time I start over and get my life together. The rumbling of bellies in need has ceased. Come, let us find a quiet place to speak. Full glad am I to have helped the people of Tuliola indeed. My colonel swelled with joy at sight of their happy and content faces. And you, friend, your kindness cannot go unrewarded. Meet me at the gate over yonder, and I'll see your duty compensated for your trouble. There you are. I hope our little excursion was as fulfilling for you as it was for me. It is a terrible thing to be hungry. Unattended bellies are quick to fill themselves with pain and anguish, feelings that will lead the heart astray. Thanks to you, my corn has sated the hunger that would otherwise invite misery to this place. I don't know, man. The place still seems pretty miserable. I think we need more corn. From the bottom of my cob, I thank you. Pray, take of my corn. May these kernels keep your belly full and spirits lifted. Now, I really must be going. Well, the people of Tuliola may be content. There are other hungry souls out there in need of nourishment. Until we meet again! I bet if we keep doing his questline, we'll get him as a minion. Like, I'm, I'm thinking maybe we'll definitely see him again.